Now, in the beginning, it might seem a little slow, but that's because, let me tell you, alert to, uh, ooh, no, 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 I'm carving a path. I'm carving a path. Oh, there's so many swarms of ghosts. Oh, there's so many of them. There's so many of them. There's so many. This game is awesome. I, I can't stop playing it. It's only $3, too. That's $3 full price. I'm your host, Get Good Fox, and I'm going to be playing Vampire Survivors for you. Only $3 on Steam. I deleted my progress. I, I No unlocks. No, nothing at all. I'm going to show you the very beginning. First character is Antonio. I'm going to show you how to play. This game gets intense. So, uh, this is a rogue game. So, it's tough, which is good. Fox likes tough. And the goal is to unlock things, and the way you do it is by attempting to survive as uh, like basically for 30 minutes. Now, in the beginning, it might seem a little slow, but that's because, let me tell you, it's given you a chance to go. So we just leveled up. When you level up, you don't actually get stronger per se, but you can pick between different items. Uh, you can either find weapons or accessories. You can have up to six weapons, and you can have up to six accessories, but there's more than six weapons in the game and more than six accessories, so you gotta pick the right combination, and they are random. Uh, you, later on, you get the ability to re-roll and, you know, try to make it better. Uh, I'm gonna go with King Bible. That's really, really awesome. I actually don't really remember what you get, what you start out with, because, like, uh... I had everything unlocked before I deleted everything. Kind of sad that I did it, but you're gonna see the King Bible floats around me. And um, one thing that's kind of weird about this game, I, I didn't I didn't know what to think about it at first, but you don't actually, you see me attacking, I'm not doing that. The character just attacks automatically as soon as he's able to. And the, the Bible that comes out, that is automatic. Like I don't, I, I can aim it in the sense, okay, so here we go. So, the ki we can pick the King Bible again. Oh, the way you level up is by picking up those gems. The gems are what give you EXP. The EXP bar is up here, by the way. So, we can get another King Bible. That's what I'm gonna do, because now we're gonna have two King Bibles. See that? In we increase the amount of projectiles, so it should make sense. You know, down there's two. So we gotta collect these gems. Killing enemies doesn't give you EXP, only picking up gems does. So we gotta, you know, if there's a bunch of, you wanna kill enemies because they drop gems. So I'm gonna use the spin of the Bible to try to carve a path into these guys. All right, we're starting to get the more advanced enemies. These guys still shouldn't be, this, the game is still taking it easy on me. Waiting for the Bibles to appear. Here we go, try to carve through them with the Bible. Use the Bible like a grinder to cut through these guys. Gotta get a, there's a boss enemy. If we kill him, we're gonna get a treasure chest. Don't, don't worry, if you think like, oh, this doesn't seem that, oh, oh trust me, like, there's, I, I have a serious doubt, I, I, I don't know if I can, I don't know if you can live the first time, I, oh, oh, damn, ah, mm, ah, getting overconfident, I'm used to playing very aggressively when I got everything unlocked, I gotta be more cautious, okay, um, ooh, I kinda want spinach, but I also wanna upgrade the whip, so the whip gets another projectile, and that means it's gonna hit on both sides now, so watch, see, it swings left and right, oh, that helps so much, the whip is honestly not a great weapon, but in the beginning of the game, it gets the job done. Using the Bible to carve a path through these guys. Here we go. Also, this game gets updates really regularly. That's another big deal. Like, this uh, this game gets... Re oh, here we go. Oh, <sighs> cutting into him right there. Where are the Bibles at? There we go. Oh, God. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, we get a bunch of EXP from that. Oh god, wait, I forgot, if there's one, there's, there's, gonna, there's gonna be three waves of them. Um, I'm gonna King Bible again. So this is gonna make the Bibles fatter by 25%, and now the Bibles are gonna spin around quicker. That's gonna, oh yeah, that's, that's more, ah! Okay, we gotta find some light sources. Uh, oh, if you think this game kinda looks like Castlevania, it's heavily, heavily inspired by Ca Bible time, come on. Bible, grind them up! Oh, there's a treasure chest. So the, the, these things here, they can give us items. Time stopper. So when the time is stopped, they um, they they won't hurt me. You know, this, so okay, we need a treasure chest. Treasure chest gives us a random upgrade to an item we have. So it's, we're either gonna get a whip or a Bible upgrade. That's fine. The whip, okay. So it's probably be more damage. I think it's just more damage from now on. Let's see. Le whip level three, yeah, damage is increased. So we just got a red gem there. Um, I, um, I really want the spinach because I need to do more damage. But I feel like what's more important than doing more damage is probably attacking more, because right now the enemy's dying one hit. So I'm gonna go with axes. The axes throw upwards in kind of like a um, 
in like a parabolic arc, basically. Um, ooh, ooh, Santa water. I, I want lots of attacks. I need as many attacks as possible. That's That should be my goal right now. Uh-oh, they're, they're closing in. Gotta use the Bibles to break out. Okay, we, we're looking for, we gotta get food items. Oh, that's awesome. So we just picked up a thing that's gonna let me just mow these guys down. Get tons of EXP. Didn't get a healing item, though. They're still frozen by the, like, the time pickup. There's another boss. There's some money. Money is used to unlock things. There's the axes that I just got. Axes are, you know, they're, they're, they're pretty. They're, they're, they'll get, they'll help. And those little puffs of water, that is the, the, the Santa water. That, oh, let me just cut through some of these guys. There are skeletons. Um, magic wand. Or, I need magic, magic wand shoots one magic bolt at the closest enemy to me, and that's what I'm worried about right now. I'm worried about the enemies surrounding me. Uh, the way you play the game at a at when you've unlocked more stuff is way different. Right now, I'm just focusing on survival. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Just grind into them. Okay, another treasure. So now we got a treasure chest. So these are our six items. So there's one more weapon we can get. Uh, so the treasure chest, I don't know what it's going to be. It's going to be an upgrade to anything. What do I... I would like more Bible. A Bible would be amazing. I want to get that Bible really leveled up. Let's see what we get. Axe, um... Two axes? If I get a second axe, that's not bad. Let me see what the upgrade is. Okay, one more projectile. That's really good. Also, we get a big chunk of gold. Ooh, laurels? Um... Magic one. So now we fire two bolts of magic. That's going to once again help me to... Uh, and like I said, you don't actually like... Uh, you know, the, all of the attacks are occurring automatically. That's fine, though, because it just lets you focus entirely on surviving. Um, ooh, area up. Oh, no, I want to shoot faster. Right now, the enemies are... They're not super healthy. We're still taking them out in one hit right now, so I'm not too... Oh, 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 big old swarm. That means there's going to be another one. I don't know what direction it's going to come from, though. I really want this big blob of enemies. Oh, there's going to be so much EXP if I can take out this big blob of enemies. Come on. There we go. Um, Whip. More area. So the whip goes deeper now. Here we go. When the Bibles are up, I can play more aggressively. And like I said, I could either use it to try to break out. That's where the, the Bibles, I can either use them to break out of the enemy formation, or I can use them to try to carve in. That's why the Bibles are so useful, though. Okay, I need to, we need to get, okay, here we go. More, um, okay, so King Bible lasts half a second longer, and the damage is increased. So, like, that's going to help us continue to one-hit some of these enemies. Here we go. There we go. A third. Oh, okay. So special. That means a boss appeared. So we got a ring of flowers blocking us in. So it's reducing our mobility. There's the boss right there. It is a big old praying mantis. So we're going to try to just wail on him right now. And we can swing before and behind. We want to take this guy out before he can. Oh, okay. There we go. Man, that's good. Like the praying mantis, you- oh, okay, so we got a mid-level chest. So the mid-level chest, three random items, three random upgrades to an existing item. There, here's the money down below. The money is 115 gold, a, a Bible, a water, uh, okay, let's see what the upgrades, the effects are. One more projectile, very good. Uh, max level for the standard weapon is eight. Another projectile, so we got three King Bibles floating around us, and... Another projectile in the Santa water. And I think it said the Santa water either lasts longer or... There we go. Three of them. Um, I think it's okay to lock in spinach. Spinach is great because it's just more damage. It just means everything does 10% more damage. And every time we upgrade it, it's going to be... An, okay, so yeah, the, the, the flowers wear off after a while. So no, nothing to worry there. Now, these guys are tougher, as you can see. They take a bit more damage, but they can drop teal gems. The teal gems are worth more, you know, kind of a compensation. Uh, we need to be looking for health. That's something I really need to do. So we need to bust open more of these torches. Once again, that's another reference to Castlevania. You know, like you would find like hidden items and stuff. There we go. Cut into the... Oh, we're not getting any healing items. Very sad about this. I mean, I'm feeling a lot better. Oh, oh, 
No, 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 no. Also, the enemies have collisions, so those swarms of bats also push people into me. That's another problem. Oh, come on, where is a... We need a healing item so bad. I need a healing item. Money. Money. Oh, we're just getting screwed right now by the lack of healing items. I, I would really just like to be like at like 75%. That would be great. Okay, look at Teal Gem. So obviously, as it should make sense that as we level up, the more we level up, the you know, like the more EXP it takes. Let me see if I can get a few Teal Gems here. There we go. I really want to kill those. Okay, here we go. Um, Bible speed and area? Yeah, good idea. There we go. Cutting through these guys. There we go. Oh, it's like, we're just like a grinder. We are literally just grinding these guys down with the Bible. It's like, basically just like drilling into like rocks. Oh, let me see if I can grind some of these guys. There we go. That's another boss enemy you can see by the aura. Uh, not all bosses have that aura, but like... The, nor the normally the bosses that have the aura are the bosses that look very similar to uh, Ooh, no, 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 ow, 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 ow. We really, we need health. We need health. I need, I need health, like, right now. Oh, that's gonna help. Oh, it's not giving me health, though. We need health so bad. Let me use that to take out the boss real quick. Um... Um... Uh, five seconds longer on the Santa. Wait, oh, we did pick this up. Okay, here we go. I really would like more Bible up. Bible upgrade or wand? Bible or wand? Whip. Um, uh, whip is kind of okay-ish. Not really what I'm looking for, though. Five extra damage. Like, the whip is all right. Oh, man, they're getting, they're getting, they're, they're getting numerous. They are getting numerous. They are getting numerous. Oh yeah, here, here's some big kills right here. Don't want them to surround me. Oh great, it's those red bats. The red bats have a lot of health. Um, King Bible? Let's just try to like get King Bible maxed out. Maximum King Bible is level eight. You use the Bibles to break out of here? Oh, the Bibles are so good. They're so good. Grinding through these fools. Let's chip away at some of these with the whips. Also, it's a pretty good idea to... Oh, oh, oh we are going to grind through those guys so well. Um, I don't think there's any other weapons. Do we use the knives? The knives will help us clear. So the knives... Uh, the knives differ in that they shoot in the direction that I'm facing. Uh, the advantage to that is I'm able to aim them as a more long-range weapon. And, uh, the adv Oh, there's a healing item. A chicken. A chicken. Give it to me. There we go. That's not enough. We're gonna need more than that, but it's a start. The- the knives, uh, you, the problem with the knives is we gotta get a few upgrades before the knives are actually worth anything. You could argue about it about several weapons, but... Uh, it feels a lot more true about the knives than some of the other weapons. Okay, we can't get surrounded by these red bats because they're they have a lot of health. They're very they're very very tankish. Okay, let me grind some of these weaker enemies up. EXP is EXP after all. Uh, let's get some more knives. Oh boy. Try to grind them up in the water as well. Uh oh, they're closing in on me. Ah, oops, ah. Oh god, it's a big swarm of bats. Oh, uh, we gotta find health. We're still we, we that that health helped, but it's it's not it's we need more. Okay, so we must have just incidentally taken out the boss. Just wore it down over time. Come on, give me um, Bibles, Bibles, Bibles. Okay, it's the the one. What's the effect? Another projectile. Base damage. Um. There we go, grinding them up. I'm doing, like, it's like when I first started playing this game, I was just getting owned. Like, I, I would have been dead by now when I first played this. Ooh, 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 I need that. Oh, we got the boss. 
The bigger one. Okay, so that thing sucks up all of the EXP, which is awesome. Okay, more more Santa water. Now we're throwing more bottles. Okay, more knives. The knives are also pretty good at taking out the bosses because we can. Ah, ow, 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 ow. We got this. I think so. I don't. I don't. I, I. I might. I don't know if we got this. I don't know if we got this. Um, we can't let. No, 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 no! Don't touch the anything but the. Okay, okay. Here's a secret. The the plants don't actually do that much damage. So we're gonna break through the plants over here. I saw a gap. Ooh, ooh, ooh! I'll take it. I'll take it. Wait, no, 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 no. No, here's the plan. We're gonna take them out. We're gonna burn them up with this. We'll use this to take out the boss. Yeah, here we go. Focus fire on the boss. Yes, we took the boss out. Get the chicken. Treasure? Oh my god! The most insane chest! This is a huge power increase! Look at the money going up to 100, 130, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 200 gold, 250 gold! 278 gold. Okay, so we got two whip ups, uh, two axe ups, and a wand. So we got um, uh, we got axe more damage on the axe, more area, and more damage on the whip. See, the whip damage isn't increasing as much, so it's like it's gonna fall off. The the okay, so now it's punch through. So the axe punches through targets. That's very important. Magic wand fires another projectile. Okay, that is a big increase in power. Big increase in power there. I'm not even. Whoa! It's a big wall. It's a huge, huge wall. Um, this is either really bad or really good. It's either really bad or it's either a lot of EXP or it's a. Oh no! It could be both. I, I'm gonna. We're gonna carve a path. I'm carving a path. I'm carving a path. I'm carving a path. I'm carving a path through them. Carving a path. Oh, there's so many of them. Carving a path. I, I, I'm getting greedy here. Oh my God! I'm just look at me just grinding. I'm just. Yeah. Oh, more projectile! I got four Bibles now! Grinding! Yeah, they only get too deep! They only get too deep! Oh, they're coming for the end! Keep attacking! Oh my god, I get, here it comes! Grind into the- oh, more, more axe projectiles and- the, Look at all that EXP! Oh, 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 carving a path! I'm carving a path! I, I here, here it comes, here, get ready for the Bibles! Here it comes! <laughs> This game is, I, I can't explain how much fun this game is. How much fun this, wait, I think that said, that was the right. Now the wands pass through enemies. We can mow these guys down. Now they, we did, um, let's take the spinach. We can start, we just want to start increasing our overall damage now. Oh my God, look at, we are just grinding these fools up. I'm gonna take them out, I'm taking them out. Oh, the werewolves are here, that's not good. The werewolves do a lot of, they're, they're very healthy. No you don't, get out of my face. Werewolves are closing in. Come on, I need the Bibles. I gotta break out. Here we go. I'm breaking out. Here, let, let's get, absorb. Get all the items. Oh, it's so satisfying. Um, knives. That'll help me punch through. So I'm gonna. I, the, the the werewolves are very healthy. I'm gonna use it to clear a path. Um, uh, the axes might need a little more damage to punch through these guys. They got a lot of health, like I said, very healthy. There's still a lot of skeletons in there. Those skeletons represent a lot of EXP. These werewolves, on the other hand, oh man, they're really, really healthy. We gotta make sure, I gotta constantly look for an exit now. Oh, now the axe has punched through four enemies. It's plus two and a plus two. Okay, so the knives are actually starting to contribute. Like I said, they're gonna help me punch through some of these. They, they attack very rapidly, too. All right, here we go. Get these skeletons out of my sight. I'm gonna try to carve into some of these. Let me get some. Oh, oh, swarms of ghosts. There's ghosts. There's ghosts. Swarms of ghosts. Oh, is that, that's a that's a wall. I can't walk through that. Oh, looking for a looking for a way through. Who? Ah, there's a health right over there. Oh, I can't get to the health. There's there's just two. Oh, oh, oh. There's so many swarms of ghosts. Oh, there's so many of them. There's so many of them. There's so many of them. I found a path right over here. I'm trying to break through. I'm trying. Oh, I'm gonna break through. I'm gonna break through. There's a the health right over there. I'm, go I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Bible's pushing him back. Oh yes. I grabbed the exp. Picking away at him. There, there's a red, red gems. We gotta get them. Like they're, they're worth a ton of exp. Um. Uh, we need, we not, not knives, knives. There we go. 
They're closing. Okay, that 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 arrow is telling me that that uh, we must have just incidentally killed a boss when I wasn't paying attention. That means there's a treasure chest there. Oh come on, not these guys now. Here we go. Um, what are we gonna get? I really need um probably one. Axes? Axes are not bad, actually. Um, 89 gold. What, what do we get? More damage? That's that's honestly not bad. Some of these enemies are getting really healthy. I'm trying to punch through a... Oh, I'm just looking for a path. Um, more projectiles. That's fine. Okay. Oh my god, we're making a... Re are we recovering? Are we recovering here? Do, do I see this? Is this that... Is this correct? I'm trying to make it through. I'm just looking for a path. Oh my god. Please spawn enemies that aren't as tanky. If we just survive long enough, we might be able to make it through this kind of wave of enemies. I'm just trying to make it through. There's a red gem. That's going to be a level up right there. Um, Maybe we need to start getting into some... Ar oh, oh man, I just took so much damage there. Oh, they're just closing in, though. There's just so many of them. There's just so many of them. This is why it's called Vampire Survivors, by the way. Come on, I'm trying to find a path. I'm trying to find a path! I'm trying to find a path! Find a path! Find a path! Find a path! Where do I go? Ah, there's nowhere to go! There's nowhere to go! We got owed. Okay, we, uh, we, that honestly wasn't bad, though. We, I thought I think we did okay. It wasn't. It, that, it, we could have been. Okay, so here's what happens. So, we got... Uh, let's see our stats. And the stats are actually kind of interesting. So, we unlocked... We, so the, we're unlocking a bunch of things. We unlocked a, a garlic weapon, the fire wand. We unlocked the vacuum. Those are more accessories. Um, the oral... Or, or, or that thingy. We got the the gauntlets. Oh yeah, look at this. We're unlocking a lot of great stuff actually. Santa water. We had the candle Labrador. The dup duplicators. Awesome. That's a great item. I wish I had that in the last one. No empty tome essential item. Uh, we unlocked a new map. Oh, reaching level twenty. That's an easy one to get. The crown. That would have been great. Crown gives you more exp. Wings. Um, not as y useful in certain circumstances. Oh, I really needed that. The hollow heart. The hollow heart is a special combo item with um, the whip. Pichone is uh, Pichone kind of sucks on its own. So look, the stats are really interesting. So the stats tell us which of these items did the most work. So King Bible did the most damage, 100 and 104,000. The, the weapon that did the next most was the axes at 84,000. So also look at the amount of time I had them. So look at this, I had the whip the longest because you know it was my starting item. And I had it for 15 minutes. And you can see right there that despite having it for a very long time, it actually did, didn't do very much damage. Like, you know, the knife kind of doesn't count because I only had it for six minutes. But, like, compared to some of the other weapons, it really it really wasn't that great. But as you can see, King Bible, absolutely amazing. Uh, the axe really cutting people down. But overall, it's really, really awesome. And uh, let me show you what you do. So we, we, we got 827 um, money. And we can use that to unlock new characters. So Imelda is only 10. Pascalina is all at 110. And Gennaro is 600. They do get more expensive as you buy them. But these are your basic four characters. Uh, they, they start with different items. So he starts with the whip, the wand. Uh, this is called the rune tracer. It's a bouncing weapon. And Gennaro starts with the, the knives. And then they also have bonuses. Like Gennaro gets a permanent plus one projectile. So he shoots more with any weapon he has. Uh, Pascalina, her weapons get faster as she levels up. Uh, that's actually really good for bouncing weapons, which is why her primary weapon is the the Rune Tracer. Imelda gets more EXP, which is awesome. Just helps her level up and build up her, her builds more. But there you go. Uh, there's a huge collection. Oh, look at all these. These are all items you can unlock. These are all different stuff to unlock. And then all this is how you unlock them. You just go through the, these unlock levels. These are all the weapons and accessories. Look, you can get a cat accessory. A cat weapon. It's a weapon. A cat. We can fight with cats. There's characters, all characters, items, all kinds of stuff. This is money. These are skips and re-rolls. They, they allow you to kind of like get your build better. It's such an awesome game though. 
I really love it. If you guys like it, if you want, I'll play some more if you want. If you guys aren't all that interested, don't worry. I'll, I'll find another game. But if the if this gets a lot of viewership, then yeah, I'll just keep playing. I'll just keep riding it out. It's an awesome game. Only three bucks. Highly recommend it. But yeah, let me know what you think down in the comments section. Very awesome game. If you pick it up for three bucks, let me know. Anyways. That is all for Vampire Survivors. I'll probably do at least one more episode. You know, we'll, we'll see how the viewership is. Do one more episode. But super awesome. I love it. A very intense game. Very awesome game. I can't wait to play more of it. Anyways, let me know anything down in the comment section. Like the videos, that subscribe for future Vampire Survivor, Survivor, Vampire Survivors content. Of course, remember that you don't have to be good to get good.